so let me give y'all a little. <laughs> Wes walked in drippy, so I'm like, as soon as he walk in, like it's cold outside, and it's I just smelled like a whiff of just like sexiness. Like mm -hmm. this, this is the epitome of like. Put the, me onto this. I've never the, the, heard the, of this the, brand. The Harmonious brand. I'm telling you, it's this is everything. <laughs> I found it in New Orleans. Um, what? No, last year. In here. Oh, you know what? This There's um. Ooh, I don't know. I should know that. You know what this reminds me of? What's that? This reminds me of psychedelic love by um, Anishia, but without that like deep dark rose. But it's something dark in here that's like real sultry yeah, yeah, and. Yeah. Oh, this I love this so much that I have it um in my car everywhere. I have the. I bought the um. Travel sizes. I love that so much. Hi guys, it's Skylar K. Welcome back to another episode of For Him. Today, I'm so excited. I know it's been two weeks since y'all seen me, but I mean, you know, I had a little upper respiratory. You know, it's January. I'm in Cincinnati. So yeah, I have my boy Wes on here. We have been talking for like, I've been on West for a minute, but we have been talking for so long for him to be on. He was out the country. He was like, I did not want to do this series without him. So I'm so happy that he's doing season two. Y'all get your hot cocoa, your snuggies, whatever, your hot toddies, because I know it's that time of year and you don't want to miss it. So stay tuned. Okay, guys. So yes, this is my boy, Wes. I'm going to let him introduce himself. What's up, YouTube? It's Wes. I actually work for a chemical company that makes a lot of the oils and essentials that go into these fragrances, but enough for me. Let me... Hold on, Wes. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait a minute. This is for you. Oh, thank Open you. Open it up now. This, this is like Merry Christmas, Happy 10,000. Yes. Open it we up. about to be at 14,000. Yeah, 14,000. That's how, that's how long we've been talking. It's one of my uh, favorite things. Okay, so it's some fragrance in wait, here. Wait, wait, wait. Open this is one of my favorite Okay, we're going to open this first. Yeah. What's the first guest? Well, second guest, but he brought me some. This look like some expensive it's Dubai my, shit. It's my favorite. Um, well, I'll let you open it. I'm excited. My whole crib, my whole crib smell like this is the best. Okay, so what is this called? This is called the brand is Volupsa, and the, the scent is crisp champagne. You gotta smell it. So I'm gonna show y'all the packaging. I normally gatekeep this candle, but I'm gonna be generous and give this one away. But I'm telling you, this scent. Wes, first of all, before I even open it, I am a candle lover. Did I you know. see it? Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, exactly. First yeah. of all, the packaging is sick, even with the sticker in here. Oh, let me smell, let me smell. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's the cat. Yeah, so I got these. I've been I've been buying this candle for like seven years. A friend of mine got it for me. And <laughs> and I've been gatekeeping it. Like I don't tell anybody what it is. <laughs> this is everything. Yeah. I'm telling you. Volupspa is like Oh my god. And it's called The brand is This smells like champagne. This yeah, smells like it smells like uh This I, is everything. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is like because I got like my higher end candles that I just like I just gotta be like, oh my, either feeling sexy or yeah. I want to just zone out and just be right, right. Uh, this one, this smells so good. A friend of mine, she, um, Jay, you know who you are. She, um, she gifted to me like this one. It was like seven years ago, and I've been buying it like ever since. I, I'm, a, I'm obsessed. So I was like, she would like that. I love this. Thank you so much, Wes. I y'all probably like, girl, you are geeky, but no, I love candles, and you yeah. definitely must have seen because it. Because people get, because people get um, too caught up into like. Trendy candles, you know, like yeah. Diptyque or Diptyque or even even the Baccarat candle. The Baccarat, Baccarat candle, candle, I just so happen to get a good batch of it, but yeah. I've heard horrible reviews that it don't last. Let me do this for you while you open the other one. Okay. But see, this right here, this candle, um, it burns the way it smells, and it burns clean, mm -hmm. and it, it, it'll stay. What is the throw like though? The what? The throw, like, is it like intimate or is it like will hey, spread through your house? Yeah, oh, it's going, it's going to light up your whole crib, like oh, for yes. days. Like, because how long do you burn it for? I burn it for a few hours and put it out, and the oil will still like permeate throughout the. Um, yes, the I love it. Yeah. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh! What? Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so yeah. much. That's 
one of my favorite. It was Y'all, crazy he bought me A Hundred Silent Ways by Nishane. It's crazy because I was watching her, um, one of her episodes, and she mentioned this, and I was like, damn, that's one of my favorite Nishane purposes too. So. Oh my gosh, <laughs> thank you, Wes. You're welcome. Fire. Fire. Yeah. Ugh. Look at the bottle, y'all. The bottle is everything. Come on, focus. Why is this going over here? There we go. That's the bottle. So I'm gonna let Wes take over because you know I let my my co-host take over. But Wes, right. he came with the Louis duffel. <laughs> this is a let me let me see the duffel. Is that? Oh uh, yeah, they don't make this no more. It's um Christopher, this, it's Christopher Neiman. Look um, at this duffel, y'all. Kim Jones. Christopher I Neiman love yeah. the print on here. Yeah, he passed so away. Well, he committed suicide actually. So I got one of the bags because Kim Jones. Kim Jones is the LB. So. I had to cop that. But, like, I'm gonna start like this. I'm gonna start with like some essentials. Like, I'm not a, I'll, I'll explain this. I'm not a trendy um, cologne buyer. Like, I don't buy trends or right. I think it's gotta smell good because if you're spending that much money, you, got, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it has to make sense. Right, so I'm gonna start out with Tiziana Terenzi um, Kirke. Oh, Kirke. So, he start, hold up, he just started out the gate. <laughs> Hitter. So Kirk A is a, a, a popular seller from Terenzi. Tiziana Terenzi. Tiziana Terenzi. I always mess it up. So if you like, Ooh, if, so if you like Herba Pure, right? Because I have Herba Pure. This is like. Um, and let them know the people that don't know Herba Pure is by Georgia. Yeah. So it's more like a, um, Ooh, a pared good. down Herba Pure. I think. Yeah, it's, it's like and not as sweet, but it's got like so. This is sweet, but it's not. It's like masculine, but not like harsh masculine. Right. It's like a sprinkle of sweet with mask. This is everything. Yeah, it's great for the summer too. Like in I the summer when you put it on. And you the bottle is everything. Yeah. I love this. Yeah. So that's Kirk. And, and so like to my fellas who like that um, uh, peach plum. Okay, Tom Ford discontinued a plum, right? Mm -hmm. So and you know a plum would gas out the whole room. So, by, I'm sorry, where is it? Byredo Bibliotech is a fire plum leather. It's crazy. Look, this right here is gonna gas out all your friends. <laughs> <laughs> we can so gas out. How, how, how many sprays do you do to Listen, this? Listen, you see my dent? You your can't. dent is like barely, y'all, you barely. Will, you will offend everybody this is plum. It's plum, leather, peach. Every note you just said is what I smell. Oh yeah, it's, it's plum, amazing. leather, peach. This is for it like a man like you, like sophisticated. French. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. this it's, is not just for you just running an errand or you no. going to even a happy hour. This is for like a event where you yeah. put it up. And when you put this it is on, so well like layered, fellas. Twenty four hours. I bet. No I'll come with something simple that I wear every day to work. Jo Malone. This is uh, Wood Sage. And oh, Sun. my favorite. Yo, look at this dent, y'all. The dent in this is <laughs> OD. Look at this. That's yes. my that, yo. This is my second bottle. It's a it's a it's a. This terrible. smells so good. This is Wood Sage and Sea Salt. I'm telling y'all, the name of this like it don't even smell like that to me. This is very earthy, but like real sexy. Yeah. This is like a sexy office scent, like. It won't be offensive, but people are gonna be like, damn. You could wear that every day. It's like a super chill everyday scent. Oh, I love this one. I, yeah. And I, they have it in, of course, the soap, the hand um, the hand cream. I love right. It. And um, one of And y'all know I get all close ups of all the bottles, so y'all won't be in the comments doing it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, one of my um, one of my favorites right now, number one is the MVP for the year mm -hmm. forever. And it's um the harmonist hitting us out of the fire awareness today. This right here. That's what you wearing today? Yeah, that's crap. Okay, y'all, so let me give y'all a little <laughs> Wes walked in drippy, so I'm like, as soon as he walk in, like it's cold outside. And it's I just smell like a whiff of just like sexiness. Like this, this is the epitome of like put me on to this. I've never that, not heard it, of this the, brand. The harmonist brand, I'm telling you, it's this is everything. <laughs> I found it in New Orleans. Um, what? No, last year. Here. Oh, you know what? This There's um. Ooh, I don't know. 
Oh, I should know that. You know what this reminds me of? What's that? This reminds me of Psychedelic Love by um, Anishia, but without that like deep dark rose. But it's something dark in here that's like real sultry yeah, yeah, and yeah. Oh, this I love this so much that I have it um, in my car everywhere. I have the, I bought the um, travel sizes. I love that so much. And it got, am I tripping? It's a little menthol in here. Let me see. No, I think that's um, clove. That's okay, yeah, clove. yeah, because I'm yeah, like, it's something. There's a the clove in here. This right here is crazy. That is, that is crack. Yeah. Is this expensive? I've never heard of it. Um, it, it'll run you around three twenty. Okay. Yeah, it's not too crazy, you know. And oh, then, you run some ones. Yeah, These yeah. are all just like. And ah. and um oh and this one I gatekeep because no one knows about it because it was um a website exclusive and like I was telling her they actually owe her money because she sold yes. so many bottles of their brand but nobody okay. nobody talks about this and I'm glad. I was at um, Essence Festival, and um, they had a um, killing, and they had actually hosted an event, and I was mm -hmm. there. And this right here. They briefly touched on. Yo, and he look, put at a the dent. Dent. <laughs> look at the dead. Look at the dead. This is the this second is, bottle. This it's is the crazy. blue moon. Look at his dent, y'all. Blue moon ginger dash. Look at that. This is the second bottle. I've never smelled this. This hit. Yeah. I love it. You know what this smell like? What's it smell like? Aquatic without that beachy and yachty yeah, yeah, smell. Yeah. It's just like watery, but like mm -hmm. masculine. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's the longevity on this? Cause it's, uh, it's, it's, it's about eight hours. Yeah. It's soft. Like I, I'm it's normally, soft, but it it smells so good. If you guys are familiar with um with the brand oh, Origins, I, I layer this with the um the Origins um ginger souffle, mm -hmm. and you can get about twelve out of it. But this right here, it smells. It's incredible. That's amazing. Yeah. And then um, for my OG people who know, who remember, because and I'm aging myself again, but it's all good. If y'all remember when Creed Aventus first came out like years ago, it's different from what it is now. Yes, it's reformulated. Yeah, they it's reformulated. It's not, it's not really, it doesn't hit. So Everybody said the first original Creed Aventus was so potent and rich and just. It, it's so good that um, I kept the original bottle. I have my bottle. Yeah, and I can you could tell the you difference. You can tell the difference, yeah. yeah. But I don't know what y'all doing over at Creed. Y'all listened, and when y'all came out with this, I've heard it is yo <laughs> Creed events is absolute. absolute that right there. So what do you think the difference with this is? This one, it's because this off top smells more rich, more oak moss, more pineapple. It's just they went back to the original, in my opinion. Yes, this is so much. Please, if y'all have the choice to buy the original or this one, please buy this one. This one is way better. Right. It's more richer. Yeah, and then um, another um, everyday scent that I love, like when I wear to work or just like getting around is Sajrat Wazi by um, Mansara. That's my and, second And stop bottle. sleeping on Mansara because yeah. they have some shit. And it's affordable too. Like this is uh, maybe like under $200. Oh, this is everything. How did you get on this? Um, this is shit, like. Shopping in Atlanta. And... Yeah. <laughs> this is like masculine, but like. What what I love spray, about your scent. What I smell, what I love about your scent so far, the notes are very like. Cohesive. Cohesive. Yeah. Yes, they come yeah. together, but they're so different. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that don't smell nothing like just smelling about. This is everything. So they got the spread. Yeah. This got some citrus in it, huh? Yeah, a lot of citrus. Yes. Now, Ooh, I now, love it. now this one, this next one, if you like black cherry, right? Mm -hmm. Um, black cherry, cinnamon, some leather, some vanilla. This ain't for, like, don't get me wrong, you got to miss a couple brunches to buy it. I have to <laughs> right. save up, you know what I'm saying? I'm right. not rich, like, I, you gotta, like, this one's gonna cost you some money, but it's worth it. Um, Clyde, Christian, jump up and kiss me. Yes, jump up and kiss me. But this is the um, hedonistic um, version. So, that's like, And he don't have the baby one. This, this is, like, the real deal. So, y'all know, Clive Christian, this is, like, this will be a for your man a Christmas birthday because this gift. is yeah, like yeah. five hundred plus. You should spray that one. So like it's, it's crazy. Black cherry, the it's amazing. Oh, that's great. 
Yes. It's so rich. But here's the thing. If you Ooh. like, if you like, um, this is the um, hedonistic version, Hold right? Up. I gotta put this up. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> but if you like. Ooh, this is so good, What? If you get the, um, I know ladies love, love don't be shy. Yes. If you get jump up and kiss me um, ecstatic, it's a richer, elevated version. That's what I was gonna say. This smells like something that I own, but it's way richer. Yeah. Where, where do you wear this to? I wear that, um, like I'm going out, you know, I, I didn't put like a big dinner in it. It's gotta be like. An event. Yeah, yeah, a special occasion. Or sometimes when I just go out, I just like to feel good or smell yeah, like yeah, yeah. cherry. But most of like when I go out to like an event or concert. Or that black cherry is hitting. Yeah, 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 the black cherry is mean on that right And if y'all, again, if y'all are like, cause some people hear one note and they just be like, the black cherry is not like that harsh black, like this yeah, yeah. is like a sweet black cherry, but it's like, yeah. ooh. But it just has um, black cherry, lemon, vanilla, oak moss, cinnamon. I'm not gonna hold and you. And the cinnamon, I, it's literally just a sprinkle. They didn't overdo it, that, I love it. Right, and then, um, oh, yeah, I wanted to bring like something for like a tip. This is an everyday, right? This is, um, I have the large bottle on this, but this is Mind Games Jado. And you can see like, the dent and this is crazy. Oh but, yeah. But it comes like this. And this is from the House of Mind Games. Okay. And um Jado. And what's so cool about them is their um their packaging is chess pieces. Oh wow. Yeah, so they come in these, but this right here, have you smelled this, Jado? No, let me Check smell it, it. Yeah, Mind Games. They were like a Neiman's exclusive. I don't know. Ooh. I like this. You know what, Wes? It's only been one other guest that came on that I like everything. Yeah. Everything that you have brought out is heavy hitters, like yeah. heavy. I like this. Yeah, I don't. I, I'm you wear this to work? I wear it to work. Okay. Yeah. This is real good. I wear it. You see, like, I, I got it. this one because like sometimes when I travel, I just travel with like a backpack. And y'all know them bag fees, so that right there, you right. can go the backpack. You, Cause you ain't really carrying these on a plane. No, we ain't doing that. Right, and then um, I think some people know about this one that are um, into fragrances. This is um, Portrait of a Lady. I wanted to smell this so bad. He bringing all the <laughs> And let me tell you something. How did you get into this? I got, I, I smelled Portrait of a Lady um, a few years ago. And well, because I wanted, because I, I got a sample of um, Briganti Concentrate, right? Mm -hmm. So the lady was like, no, you have to smell this. And, and you know, I'm a Rose Oud dude. This right here is Rose Oud, rich, it's, it's out the park. And see, I had just started getting into Oud, so I got yeah, yeah. Ombre Nomad, I have Oud Satin Mood, and I also have, um, what am I thinking of? Hold up, this just took me off. I got a few oohs, but I'm gonna have to get this. This right here is my uh, my layer. Like I'll layer this, this with, so with um, this one right here. These two together. I bet nobody, that's crazy. Yeah, ain't nobody messing with you. And it's crazy because this smells like ooh with like a hint of citrus. Yeah, it's a. I know there's a rose in there. It's a ood. This is everything. Yeah. This is definitely the definition of winter, though. You cannot wear this in the summer. Yeah, people who like to smell really masculine. If you're into like people like citrus scents, right? But a lot of the citrus scents sometimes are masculine. 1872 Clyde Christian is masculine, grown citrus. This is where you like linen up. Okay. Hey. The all is, white this summer is the all, party. This is the all white summer party. This is 1870s because yeah, you have to you have to spread because it, it, it changes. Like initially when you smell it, you smell like the um the Sicilian orange scent, but then it um, it changes. It's you super masculine. This, you will probably like the feminine. You know what this smell like to me? Will this like will be in the same house as that Tom Ford, uh, the the blue bottle that's see through. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, it's called um, Alpha. The, uh, yeah, it, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. This would be like in the same family as this, but this is like for this to be a freshie. This is a five hundred dollar freshie, y'all. So don't get it twisted. This is How, the, what's the longevity on this? Twelve hours easy. This is the masculine version. It comes in a feminine version and it's softer. That's so, so good. So so yeah, you can. And then like again, like we were all mad at um, Creed for years, y'all. 
but they came out with this with the with the um, get the one with the um, steel cap. This batch Creed Aventus Cologne, yo. Let me smell this. <laughs> you got some shit. I I told y'all I was waiting forever for him to come yo, out. The steel cap. Oh, not it's busting. They nailed it with that. This is real sexy. Look at the dent in that bottom. Yeah. <laughs> y'all, y'all can't even see like, look at this. You can't even see the cologne in here. You, oh my gosh, you love this. I love it. This is like, this had me in a chokehold all last um, summer because it lasts for 12 hours. So how many sprays do you have to do with that? Cause it's light, but I, it's hitting. I do like three, three or four, but I'm, a, I'm not gonna front. I'm a, I'm a heavy sprayer, but. It's funny because like the more you heat up, it this this heats up. But and make sure you it make if you can't get the we get the um the batch with the um the steel cap. Is this a good collector bottle just to have in your collection? Yes, I love it. Um, what else do I have? Oh, and then the other one from um Byredo. If you can see the dent in this, this is on um, Baldi Afrique. That's uh, one of their popular sellers. Love it. Yes. This is really good. Now y'all know I don't multiple spray. I got a thousand dollars worth of. <laughs> this is so so good. And this is unisex too. A lot I, of I, I feel like I feel like that's like um, a serious person scent too. You yeah. Know what I mean? Like like uh like the woman from Devil Wears Prada, like the the executive. Yeah, it's like she a, would probably wear this. It yeah, it's like a businessman. You're or not, Chris like, Jenner. Yeah, you're not. You're I can not. see where Chris Jenner. Let me see. It. The notes in here is like um, a lot of women think it comes it, it um, leans masculine, which it does in my opinion, but it's more like yeah, I'm trying to see like what it looks like. Yeah, this is I love it. I love them. This is this is good. Oh. West did not gonna play y'all over here in ah and then shot. And then you know, you know, like I said, um, damn, I wish I knew that lady name that turned me on in Saks to like buying perfumes. Mm -hmm. But I know somebody in the comments they're gonna know this from Cincinnati that went to Saks because she wore glasses. She was the only black woman like behind the counter. Mm -hmm. But um, it, one of the, she got me to get this scent and it's a four lifer, right? I'm gonna have it for. And y'all know I love a four lifer. Everybody, y'all, uh, y'all have, have to get this. I have never seen that. This is, I'm gatekeeping it. Wes? I'm gatekeeping it. No, no, no. No, you got this, uh, this is a new bottle, right? Oh, uh, it's about a year old. Yeah, because they changed the, yeah, 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 uh, yeah. the next on here because yeah. the gold ones were breaking. So that's why I'm like, how the hell is this a for life? But oh, they yeah. came out with their originals again. Yeah, yeah. So I've been wearing this for like 10 years. This is probably like my fourth bottle. It's a four life. Let me smell Same. this. Uh, me this is Tony spray. Allen by Bond. Yeah, this uh, this uh. uh Y'all see this expensive ass bottle? He just spraying. <laughs> yes. This is like citrus. You smell that? Yes. Yo, it's like. Do you smell that? It's like. <sighs> Here, I'm afraid I'm here. No, you got it. Yeah, yeah, I love it. This is like a pina colada, a This pineapple. is definitely summery. The, the longer, the higher you get, like you out sweating, it just start coming through. Coming through your pores. Yeah, yeah. That's a four lifer. Like, I, I'm gonna have I'm This probably it for a busts on you, huh? Yeah, I've been wearing it for a very long time. This is Coney Allen by Bond. And I love the bottle. I love how it's like. And and um and she talked about this one a lot on the show. Oh, well, I've, I've seen it a lot. And she didn't like it, but one of her guests, me and her guests, actually bonded over this because I told him about it. This is a for life. That is Wall Street by Bond yeah, number nine. It's a for life. Yeah, I'm gonna have it forever. This is now yours. Yours smell like I, that orange note is there, you like at the oranges? top. Yeah, it's citrus. This is this is like a citrus orange. Now yeah. hold on, Wes. One thing that I've noticed in your collection, your collection like it went like. It hit a U-turn and went down the alley. <laughs> then we back yeah. on the main road. Like he got a lot of like deep, rich fragrances. Then he got the ones that's like a light, a light sweetness, yeah. but earthy, still masculine. It's like layered. Yeah. And then you got your your aquatics and your freshies are crazy. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I, and like I like. Um, so how do you know what to pick, pick out, Wes? Like pick, when do you know? Like today I'm wearing this. If, oh, because like if I'm if it's like a summery light day, 
I want to smell like a pina colada, you know what I'm saying, killing it, but, or I'm going to go to the um, Killian's ginger, but I want to be like, feel like, you know, you about to have some company, Yo. <laughs> that's a panty dropper? Yeah. That's, that's what's funny, y'all? This, this panty is a panty dropper, yeah. This is. That's a panty dropper. Then the, um, the, the Mancera Sadrab YZ, like this one, you can't really get the initial um, scent of it by like smelling. This changes like two or three times. I, I kind of like fragrances that do that sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Cause it's like, okay, once you get to the uh, base notes, it's like, hold up, yeah. hold on the fragrance. But um, Portrait of a Lady, and if you guys got these, like, put these two you together. You wear those? Do. <laughs> what it's, is this on D? It's, it's insane, it's on D. So I got a question, Wes. Yeah. For a person that's like, okay, they wearing their Dior's, they wearing their Prada's, they wearing their this, just the designer. Yeah. What would you suggest for a person that's like, you know what, I wanna really step into the niche world and I wanna just really, I got the money to spend, but I don't know where to start. Where would you, like, suggest to the guests because I know it's a lot of people that they don't even know about niche and then if they do know about niche they only know about a creed or a bond so yeah, yeah. aside from the creed or bond what would you suggest to that person um, that's just like you know just start getting money or you know they just want to branch out and you know yeah, step it up if, if, if I was to like tell somebody to get something and they just wanted to like treat themselves I would go with um, the Harmonist brand and I didn't bring them but me and Skylar we can chop it up next time but uh, Mind Games has some crazy, they doing some crazy stuff over there. But I will go with um, the Harmonist. This is looking like the star player today. Right. I love that so much. And um, this is so good, it's so layered. And you know what? I didn't bring I see why you got that in your car. Like the yeah. more I smell it, yeah, yeah. I will want everything to smell like that. Yeah. Oh but, my God. But I didn't bring them today, but I have a lot of Tiziana Terenzi. Mm -hmm. If you if you're looking to get into niche and you when you want to blind buy, okay, let, let me put this out there. Don't blind buy this one. Don't blind buy. Uh, I don't know which one you. They should. I would say don't blind buy this yeah. one. And I will also say don't lie by yeah, Portrait of a Lady. Lady. You're specific. These are very specific and these are fragrances that you already have like at your feet wet. And not saying feet wet just as like, oh, I got one niche. These are like when you well into it, you know where to layer it. I mean, not layer, sorry. You know where to wear it, what season to wear it. These aren't just the plate black. Cause if you buy this, I'm gonna tell you, you buy it, you just, you might not like it. Yeah. Cause like my taste and fragrance has changed Right. I used to hate Oops at Moon. Yeah, yeah. And then I had, I was like, oh my gosh. I was just like, that's how I play with my fragrances. I'll just spray it on my wrist while I'm at home. Yeah. And then as it developed, after I got over the initial harshness of it, and that vanilla rose was able to peek through, I was in love. Yeah, yeah, that's one of my favorites, um, Oops at Moon. But, um, but my favorite fragrance. But this is good. Bibliotech, Library in French. That's crazy. <laughs> this is a gasser. This is this is gonna gas the the whole you whatever your friends wearing, they're not they not seeing that. They're, they're not gonna be able to um project over you with this if you want to wear that. This is everything. But but but, if I, but honestly, like my top two, if I was to tell somebody to buy something, my favorite, I didn't bring it, is um Virgin Island Water by Creed mm -hmm. and um the Harmonist, I'm Hymn is How the Fire. Those two this you should have in your collection. Well, she put me on. Yeah, that's, that's fire. <laughs> I love. So now we gonna ask you some questions yeah. because Wes has always been drippy ever since I've known him. And I just wanna know Wes, because you have such a broad collection. Like, I mean, y'all know when I'm in awe, I'm like, like a kid in a candy shop. I wanna know like, so for those people that's like, okay, cause I'm gonna leave his Instagram or whatever. How did you even know like to dibble and dabble in different fragrances? Do you like, do you sample? Do you sometimes just read reviews? Do you like, how do you even know? How would someone know to even go to this brand, to this house and just? Well, I stumbled onto um, Him That's Out of Fire and Neiman's um, by accident because like, I like fashion. So I was actually like, I like wearing um, Comb or Rick Owens. Um, so I was just buying some stuff and I stumbled upon that. But normally what I do, I tell people to do this all the time. And it's a, it's a, um, it's a, actually a trick. Go to the manufacturer's website and um, buy the discovery set. 
so yes, when, I'm so big on discovery so when, steps, so and so I tell you buy, So, like, let's say, for instance, like, Him This House of Fire, it comes in a discovery set, right? They're going to take the money, like, let's say, for instance, the discovery set is $55. So what you do, you get to take the discovery set home and you get to sample it or whatever. And then the money that you spent for the discovery set goes towards your purchase. And a lot of people don't know that. Yeah, so that in full, it goes to your purchase full because they want you to come back. So a lot of times, definitely, I got like tons of discovery sets at home. You know, I'll hear about something because I never blind buy. The only thing I blind yeah, buy. Yeah, so I'm ask you, have you ever blind buy? Because nah. I had some successful blind buys. Yeah. But the worst blind buy I ever had was from Le Labos and it was Santel 33. Right. The worst fragrance I ever saw in my life. People don't like that, but I really like it. You like it? I like it. I, I, what do you like about it? Because you know what they say in reviews that it smells like, for me, it smelled like pine, but a lot of people say it smells like dill pickles and pine mix. It reminds me, I don't know, I like it a lot. It reminds me of the um, Creed Santal, so mm -hmm. that's Creed, what it yeah. is. But yeah, I never um, blind buy because this shit costs too much money. Like, yeah, up, so man. would it be in winter time that you have like, do you do oils, do you do like pair with like body creams from the yeah, fragrance? Yeah, 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 I, I do. A lot of times for longevity, I'll just put it in like basic baby oil. Oh, okay. And the, you put the baby oil on with like, especially like with this, I'm telling you, it's like all day. So you mix it with the baby oil yeah, and, and, just put it on. Yeah. and it lasts. Yeah, you make your own oil. Okay, then. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm so grateful that you came. Thank you for um, having me. I, I'm telling you. Um, we have been planning this for over probably, what, wait, six months? What's this been a minute? The mess? Estee Lauder group? This woman has sold hundreds of bottles of Love Don't Be Shy. <laughs> She's a killing spokesperson. You guys don't cut her a check. Now. <laughs> Hennessy, now. Henne Killian Hennessy, yo, get with her. Yes. And Thanks again, out. thank you so much for my gift, so Wes. Y'all seen the gifts. I'm so excited. And Wes will be Pinky Swear. I promise. He I'll gonna come back, back on for the summer edition because yeah. you men, y'all need to know what to wear in the summer. Don't just throw on no baby lotion and think. <laughs> they be throwing on that baby alive lotion and coming outside smelling <laughs> like they trying to give you a baby. We need to smell, you yeah, know? Yeah. So thank you again, guys. Thank you for having me. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll leave all this information. And Thanks. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.